brakes, doing the front brakes, driver's side, brake fluid reservoir, I removed the cap, easier to compress the pistons to me, 22 millimeter lug nuts, 5 lugs, 14 here, and a 14 down there. Take those off now to remove your caliper. Alright, both 14s been removed. Now we're just going to remove our caliper. There's a pry bar right in there, pry back on it, pull it off. Alright, caliper has been removed. We're going to compress our piston. We also removed our old brake pads. Let's compress our piston and install our new brake pads now. Alright, so our inside pad. So it makes a wear strip on the same side as the old one. This is our inner pad. Alright, so we have both new pads installed. Piston's been compressed in our caliper. Just gonna put it back on now. Our right, caliper has been reinstalled. Put back in your two number 14s. Tighten them down. All right, calipers installed. 14s are in and tight. Top and bottom. Put back on your wheel. Cover back your reservoir on the driver's side. Pump your pedal before you drive off. That's the Equinox front brake pad replacement. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, comment, hit that like button. See you next time.